Good morning guys and welcome back. So today we're at Budrum Waterfalls. This is like literally five minute drive from my house um, at the base of Budrum. Um, if you guys are coming from Alsbury, I'd recommend getting off at Sunshine, off the Sunshine Coast Highway, heading towards Kind of Park and just going off Jones Road. It's really close to a lot of shops, so if you guys have kids or you want to stop for a coffee, you can do. Now most of this is a boardwalk, so it's perfect for prams or wheelchairs. Uh, just ab above us is not uh, boardwalk so be mindful you get about 15 20 minutes of boardwalk before it actually goes to dirt and rock absolutely beautiful surrounded by surrounded by native trees we're about to head up to the main waterfalls take some photos and have a look around there's also beautiful waterfalls on the boardwalk side as well so you guys can't get that far if you've got young kids or you're in a wheelchair um, or elderly people you can't um, hit the harder stuff there is a few rocks um, and stuff you've got to jump over as you'll see in a minute and um, there's still some beautiful walks um, and waterfalls as you go up the boardwalk as well so let's have a look as you can see a lot of this is carved but it's not real wheelchair or pram accessible there's a few steps to go up to uh, Better lookout area that actually goes to the bigger waterfall and a bridge. Go down this one first because there's a couple of different lookouts um, and a couple of different waterfalls as you go along. As you come through. Alright, so a pretty nice walk, perfect day in the trees. They've got a great little facility here in Budrum with the boardwalk. Not sure, I think it's owned by the council, it used to be private land. Um, I think some of the waterfall is still privately owned now, which is pretty cool. Um, having that on your property would be awesome, but I'm pretty sure most of it's owned by the council. Now just before you uh, come in at the car park, which is always pretty busy, um, but there's always lots of parking. So if you're coming on the weekend, uh, there's always probably one or two parks. But there's a field so you could bring a picnic basket, a blanket, have a nice little picnic, bit of lunch in there as well. Um, but the track itself, with the boardwalk, um, walking up to waterfall, with taking videos and pictures, probably took about 45 minutes, um, maybe a little bit less. If you do have kids and stuff like that, obviously it will take longer. It's not very hard, a few big rocks to jump over and stuff like that. So um, if you do have someone like um, an alley person that can't walk on those harder tracks, uh, you can still go up to some really nice waterfalls just before those parts. So it's just a great Sunday walk, some really nice waterfalls, um, and just great to get out amongst the trees. 
But if you guys like these new videos, smash that like button and let me know in the comments what you guys think about these new videos. Um, I'll be uploading more. Hopefully we can still go out to New Zealand. Um, we were supposed to go on Monday tomorrow, but they put a 72 hour ban on any flights um, to New Zealand from Australia, which sucks. So we missed out and we'll probably have to spend some more money to get a later flight maybe on Wednesday. So we should still be going, but it's pretty unclear at the moment. But in New Zealand, we'll be doing a lot more of these sort of videos, exploring some forests, um, back roads and stuff like that. Uh, but let me know if you guys like these videos, it's a little bit of a change from the normal Jeep videos we normally do, um, which I'm more excited about. Um, it's a lot nicer, a lot easier to watch sort of stuff. Um, and I'm hoping you guys are enjoying it as well. But that's pretty much it for today guys. If you like this video, smash that like button and subscribe button. And thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.